Hey guys, it's time to unbox the new LG V20. Finally, it's the first time ever that I've bought a V series phone from LG. I missed on the V10 and now I bought the V20 phone and I will be uh, giving you guys my full review, my honest usage report and everything about this phone, speed test, camera reviews and all that stuff that you guys are interested in watching and also uh, if we talk about the price of this device it is costing around $700 so you can convert that into your country's respective currency and that's what I have to say about the price so yeah this is a flagship phone from LG here uh, and this is here uh, the v20 i have it has gone a lot cheaper uh, at first it was costing like 600 something and now it is uh, in 400 something price point so it's costing really less so you can buy the lg v g5 also if you are interested and you want to save money but v20 is a pro phone okay so if you want to go all out and buy the latest one then this is the one to go for so i'm just gonna quickly Peel the plastic off here. And I heard a lot of good things about this phone. So we also have, okay, no more seals. It just slides out. And what is this? Okay, it says life's good when you play more. That is nice. And wow. Super good boxing, I should say. I mean, super good box. So here we have the phone itself, V20. And oh, I can pull this one up here. Okay, there we go. I'm such a noob. So this is the phone and it is feeling really light, which is because the battery is not inside. So we got the phone. I'm just going to place it, place it on the side. And this is the paperwork. This is the battery we have here. So you can see that it is a big battery. And let's take a look at, okay, nothing more. And on this side, we got the official LG fast charger here, which is also good. You can see, looking pretty nice. And then we have the USB cable, which is obviously a type C cable type c to usb cable so and that is all we also have this thing here which is probably the the headphone so let me just quickly open this one up and these are the headphones we have looking very similar to the ones that i got with the lg g4 so yeah that's what we have in the box and uh, let's put the battery inside of the V20 and power this bad boy up. So this is a 3200 mAh battery and it's going to power this uh, 5.7 inch 1440p display here. And obviously I'll be making a video about the battery also. So uh, I think we can uh, open this back by pressing this button here. There we go. And this is not plastic, okay? This is a solid piece of metal. So it's this uh, super premium phone and still it has this removable back. That's, is the, that's the speciality we have with LG. So uh, let's just press it like this. And now it is closed. So I do have a plastic on the back. I'm just gonna peel this also there we go so super premium phone uh we have that dual camera setup on the back so 16 megapixel f 1.8 uh plus 8 megapixel here uh for of course that um you know wide angle pictures and we got the fingerprint sensor on the back uh on the front you can see that we do have another piece of plastic i guess so i'm just gonna quickly peel this one also and this is like i said it's a five 0.7 inch display with the secondary display also so i'm gonna power on this phone and yes this phone has the battery in uh, battery juice you know because i unboxed like three phones 
uh, earlier and all these all those three uh, did not had any like battery so that is really good from LG so yeah it's a 5.7 inch uh, quad HD display and also it's having Snapdragon 820 plus 4 gigs of RAM I mean performance wise you're not going to be having any issues and also it is Android 7.0 NuGet or maybe 7.1 but it is Android NuGet uh, so it's actually the first phone to have Android NuGet even before Nexus devices uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and skip all this stuff obviously you can set your ID and everything so and we are done so yeah just give it a second to settle up so as you can see there is the secondary screen we have on top and like I said this is the first time I'm having a experience with the LG uh, V device you know I did not bought the V10 so it's first time for me and I'll be doing my review on the what you call the the f full phone and as well as my experience with the secondary display so that will be interesting so uh, if we go into settings and we go into general about phone and you can see that we have if we check software information Android 7.0 NuGet so you got a bunch of different home screens and uh, you can also have the uh, the app drawer enable if you want to. Let's take a quick look at the secondary screen we have. So it allows you to have uh, some quick toggles like Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, and Torch. And you can also swipe here to basically see uh, other options like the Google Now. I think, yeah, this is Google Now. And also we got the, the memo. We got the clock, files, and settings. And then we have the signature, which you can also edit. So overall, uh, I basically enjoy LG's UI a lot. I mean, I've used the G4, the G5 as my main device for some time. And I really enjoyed the build quality of this phone. Feels a lot premium compared to the V, uh, I mean, the G5 here. So it is having really good feel. And this one, if you guys remember, had like uh, paint. Uh, on top of it so it created a lot of controversy but this is a great phone like I said it has gone a lot cheaper so it definitely worth the money now uh, and uh, of course if you can if you can spend more then you can have this one so if we just quickly take a look at the camera here so like I said that does have secondary camera sensor uh, we can see that we do have the the secondary screen uh, and on that we can see the the options like auto manual and video manual so video manual is the mode where you have a manual video mode so you can uh, change everything like focus white balance and ISO uh, basically gives you a lot of options and you can also switch to the wide mode uh, which you know basically enhances everything which is great and you can also see that it has a really good mic system audio system you know it's uh, it has like really good noise cancelling like you can record uh, your audio in a really noisy environment and it's gonna do a great job although I'll be testing that out and we'll make a separate video on that I think it's gonna be a really good um, vlogging phone you know uh, with its really good audio capabilities so uh, when you lock the phone uh, the the, uh, the secondary screen is always on like you can play with it without even unlocking the actual phone so um, that is really good and you can double tap to unlock the phone so uh, yeah I will be doing a, my full review on this phone I'll be checking out some speed tests you know see uh, how it stacks up against the competition what kind of uh, improvement we have as far as the speed goes with the NuGet uh, and our NuGet and uh, yeah let me know what specific videos you guys want me to make and I'll see you guys in my next video peace